Hey, what's up everybody? Neil here. Today I'm going to show you how to add a row of numbers to your Google Keyboard. So let's show you Google Keyboard right now. Um, this is a fake conversation that I was having with myself, so don't worry about that. Um, Alright, so I have the Google Keyboard uh, applied right now. And there's a top row with letters that you can access numbers from by holding down and then doing that. But honestly, I just like having the numbers on their own row like um, like certain other stock keyboards do, like the Samsung keyboard, but I don't like using the Samsung one. So for whatever reason, let's just say I'm using Google and I want a top row of numbers. It's just easier, it's more fluid when you're typing, you just have the numbers there, you don't have to hold down a letter or anything. So I'm gonna show you how to basically add that to your keyboard. First thing you wanna do, remove any Google keyboard that you may have. Now you can do this either by going into your app drawer and locating Google Keyboard and you can just tap and hold and uninstall up above or you can actually go into your settings my phone oops sorry go to more application manager and then you have to search for Google key Google Keyboard and you just hit uninstall okay so this is a modded version of the Google keyboard we're going to acquire so you will have to enable unknown sources go back into your settings go into security it's under more sorry go into security go to unknown sources and check that this will allow you to install apps from sources other than the keyboard okay so in the full guide I give you the link to the APK so go ahead and download that I already have that in my actual downloads so let's just go to downloads so now I'm going to do the installation process install after it installs you're just going to hit open and it'll prompt you to actually enable it and set it as your default so right now I'm just going to enable the input Google keyboard okay then we're switching the input method English US Google keyboard and that's it and now you're done. Now go to your messaging or wherever you use it and check out that row of numbers now. So I definitely like it. It's an improvement, especially in the context of functionality. So check out the full guide. It's uh, pretty laid out, simple with steps and all the links you need. And if for whatever reason you want to go back to the regular Google keyboard without the numbers, just um, just uninstall this version like I showed you and then download the most latest version on Google Play of Google Keyboard. So, as I said, check out the full guide. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe for more useful videos. And thanks for watching.